Slash picture rocks area. This is one part of town that was hit particularly hard today with it was never a severely worn storm, but I was looking at it. I was seeing the amount of uh, lightning we had the hail tracks and it looked to me like it was at least a very strong storm. We have some reports of some power poles down and that's where we find news for Tucson's Cristiano Ramos joining us live. Cristiano, what can you tell us? I got to think that those uh, gusty winds really must have been a factor in some of this. Oh, definitely. This area in particular was hit pretty hard from just what we're seeing. We were driving down um, Tucker Road here. This is in Avra Valley, and you can see that roads here are flooded. You can make puddles. I tucked in my pants here, too, so I look like Star Wars. But even the sides of roads, look at how much rain was gotten here. As for the winds, you mentioned it, the power pole. So on this road here, this is near Anaway Road. You can see two poles were completely snapped in half. They fell over, so we are hearing reports that there are some residents uh, here without power right now. And then down this road here, when you go, I'm gonna have, we're gonna pan over there, uh, Angela, my photographer there, so you can see some power poles, more power poles are uh, tilting a little bit over, so we're hearing from a resident who told us that um, even power over on that side is also out, and that some residents can't even get to their homes because there are other power lines and poles down that way that are um, also all the way completely down. So you can see that uh, the police there, they did block off uh, with that road there with cones. So it's just not safe. We're even hearing reports of some cars being stuck because roads are flooded. So obviously there was pretty good amount of rain to flood roads and there was a pretty strong enough winds to knock down some of these power poles. I mean, I was even looking around and we spoke to one resident. His name's Michael. He didn't want to go on camera, but his front yard is completely flooded. It's like a swimming pool. It's a swimming pool you don't want in Arizona. So it's going to be a big cleanup for the next couple of days here. Um, I do want to know, Matt, though, because I like